so before we get into today's video i just wanted to thank peeler so much for sponsoring these are my absolute favorite phone cases i did get a new phone recently so had to get a few new ones and this purple one is the one that i'm using at the moment these cases are so protective i feel like my phone is very safe. They're also 100% compostable, which is amazing. Peeler's mission is to create a waste-free future. So if you are in need of a new phone case, I would highly recommend checking them out. I also have a code. The first 50 people who use the code NANA will get 40% off their order and then 25% for everybody after that. So really exciting. Thank you so much to them for sponsoring. I hope you enjoyed the video. I went on the loveliest trip to Oslo to see Shreya. She's on her year abroad there and I haven't been able to see her for months and months so I'm just so grateful and feel so so lucky that I was able to go on this trip and I hope you enjoy the video. we ate dinner at Oslo Street Food which was this big market with lots of different cuisines. I ended up getting a poke bowl and Shreya got Indian food, both of which were delicious and we just sat here and chatted for ages. Obviously we haven't seen each other in person for such a long time so this was a lovely evening. <laughs> thing that we're gonna jump into the water apparently. I think it's gonna be really cold. So the exhibition at this museum that we went to was all about scent which is so interesting. I've never been to anything like this before but there was lots of artwork, immersive experiences and you'd kind of walk around and smell a ton of things which is so interesting as a concept
They also had the sauna thing, which we did right after attached to the museum. And the way that it links in is that they would spray this money scent onto the coals and that would kind of like smell of money within the sauna, which was a really interesting. Um, but it also gave us a way to jump into the fjord, I think is how you say it, which was unbelievable. It was genuinely so cold this day. Like I'm talking minus seven degrees, the coldest weather I've ever experienced. It didn't go above zero the whole time I was in Norway, which is crazy to me. Um, but jumping in that water was like something I will never forget. It was unbelievable. Sunday we had a little bit of a lion before bracing the cold and going on one of the most beautiful walks I've ever been on. This is a lake not too far from where Shreya lives and we caught it right at a beautiful hour. The sun was kind of setting and it was just like kind of golden hour which was so pretty. This was genuinely I think the coldest I have ever been in my life. Um, I definitely should have worn more clothes but this was one of the most pretty beautiful places I've ever been.
that afternoon ice skating at the winter wonderland this was unlike any ice skating experience i've had in the past whenever i've gone in the uk it's been super busy you have to book a time slot and all of this but here in oslo it was very very laid back and chill you literally just walk onto the ice there's no barriers or anything i don't know if this is interesting but it was interesting to me everyone was obviously unreal we were so embarrassed by how bad we were but look how lovely and empty it was we had it all to ourselves basically <laughs> day I caught a flight home but I had the loveliest trip and I am so incredibly grateful that I got to go on it thank you so much for watching this week's video I hope you have a lovely week I love you so much and I'm sending all the love and kisses and hugs bye